I don't like it here. I want to go. I don't know what to do. What to do? What to do? I've no mother or father to speak of, you see. So the nice people at the Gracious Hand take care of me. I wanted to get them a present to say thank you. And I thought a bunch of flowers would be just the thing. Now the problem is, I can't seem to find any good ones. Do you think you could help me? All I need is a bunch of pretty flowers. For true. Thank you ever so much, Arisen. I'm sure you'll find the prettiest flowers there ever were. not complete our delivery while we're here perhaps once we've concluded this bit of business we might allow ourselves a moment's rest I quite agree hoy arisen have you brought me a bunch of flowers already Oh, just look at them. They're the most beautiful flowers I've ever seen. <laughs> These should brighten the sisters' days. Say, would you mind terribly if I asked you another favor? See, one of my friends taught me a magic spell. It's supposed to let you meet whomever you like. All you have to do is find a silver stone, put it under your pillow, and say the magic words. But there's the problem. I've been looking all over for such a stone, and I can't find one anywhere. Would you find a silver stone and bring it to me, Arisen? For true. I knew I could count on you, Arisen. I'll be waiting. Our next mission is to acquire a silver stone. Mayhap silver ore will serve. We can purchase it or mine it up ourselves. I quite agree. I overheard some of the soldiers standing guard outside the palace discussing a curious rumor. Oh, did it pertain to the Queen Regent and an important personage, perchance? Indeed. Some suppose there is more to her relationship with this Batali dignitary than is publicly known. Hmm. 
How are we to get through this door? Some of our foes are proficient at ranged attacks. They will prove most troublesome if not dealt with swiftly. It is easily done. today. Here we are. Oh, I can't find a silver stone anywhere. Have you fared any better? Oh, just look how it shines. Thank you ever so much. Say, aren't you curious who I want to meet? Well, I'll tell you. My mother and father. I don't even know what they look like, you know. Not to say I'm unhappy at the gracious hand, of course. But I'd really like to meet them, even just once. I want to tell them how grateful I am that they gave me life. Oh, it's so shiny. Oh, hi, Arisen. You'll help me again if I need it, won't you? Please say yes. Miss Daphne seemed pleased with our efforts. Mayhap we ought to pay her another visit sometime soon. Right you are. It is quiet about. I barely slept a wink. Crowds can be troublesome. Let's be on my guard. Oh dear. Do you mind coming over here?
Off we trot. I've trained for this. Off we trot. An ox cart ought to make our journey easier. They can be most convenient, though they only travel during the day. I'm off to the tavern. Can't wait for the new equipment. Not sure why I'm trolling. We've reached our destination. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Enough That's enough. What to do? What to do? Hoy arisen. Say, have you heard about the state of the river? Do you know the river close by the church? Well, it's come to be full of muck and filth and all sorts. That's a problem for the church, as it draws from the river to make holy water. The water's so filthy that it's going to take twice the amount of gold ore to purify it. I was thinking you could help the priests by finding some gold ore. After all, it wouldn't be good for anyone if the church ran out of holy water. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Thanks ever so much. I'll help, too. I'll look for gold ore every place I can think of. Now we seek gold ore. Though it is sold in shops, mining some ourselves might prove the better choice. Right you are. Oh, it's not right. It doesn't make any sort of sense. The doctor examined him afore and said he'd be better with a bit of medicine. Yet ere since he came here, he's only gotten worse. I understand how you must feel. But you must see that your son's health continues to wane. There is no medicine that can heal him outright. He requires proper treatment. I am caring for him as best I can. I beg only for your patience. However, if you truly cannot entrust him to me, perhaps you would care to take him home with you instead. Mayhap convalescing in a place familiar to him would aid his recovery. Of course, I would be sure to visit him as oft as I am able. Uh, home, you say? Dear. We are pressed enough, as tis. All right, he stays. But pray, bring my son back to health. I will look after him. I swear it. A fine place to harvest some ingredients. I say we collect as much as we can carry.
Come to think of it, we might already have what we seek stored away. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin gets the woe, as they say. I grant you lightning's fangs! Pray, follow me. Would seem we have aught we need to hand. This might contain useful information. A thorough perusal might reveal aught of interest. Master. Who are you risen? Have you found any gold ore yet? Wow! This'll be plenty, I reckon. Thank you ever so much. Listen, I was talking to the priests, and apparently our troubles aren't over yet. Would you be willing to lend us a hand again, Arisen? Just one more time. Thanks. So, remember how I told you about the river by the church getting all mucky? Well, the grown-ups are saying it's gotten worse. Now lots of people who live nearby are falling sick. The priests have been treating everyone as best they can, but there's nowhere near enough medicine to go round. I want to help them, but I'm not sure what I can do. Apart from ask you, that is. Would you bring us some more medicine, Arisen? Oh, thanks, Arisen. What would we do without you? I'll talk to the priests in the meantime, see if there's anything useful I can do. Now, we've need of medicine. We can purchase it at shops, or make some ourselves by combining the ingredients. Understood. Arisen, have you brought any medicine with you?
Not yet. Fair. Share with me your troubles. I've been here so long, I almost forgot why I'm trying to make the easy pickings. It's on me to bear what younger shoulders can't. Fancy a look at my wares? Do come again. No purchases to be made today, I see. I just hope the shopkeep understands. Browsing was enough to scratch the itch, in my case. Might as well take a look while you... You're here, eh? Stop by again soon. with you. Now that's just splendid. Oh, thank you, Arisen. This should be plenty. I'll take it to the church straight away. It is a goodly deed we've done aiding the sick. I only hope our efforts go a waste toward improving life in the slums. I quite agree. <laughs> 